Welcome back to the Booniverse. We are back in Lens Island, or Nick's Island as I like to call it. And we are just about to make a smelter. This thing's been making some... Extinguished, thank you. It's been making some metal parts for me. I do you think I need to extend the base at some point, but at the moment I'm just going to put this at the foot of my bed, because, you know, that's where you keep your smelters, isn't it? So with the smelter, again, we need to put a little bit of fuel in, so we're going to do that. Let's put in five. Now, we need to put in metal parts, five metal parts, and five of these, and it will make us some bars. They're bars, bruv. So we need to smelt down a few more of these. So I'm going to go collect some rock. And then we're just going to smelt down as much rock as we possibly can. So I've actually got a skill point to spend, I believe. And I'm going to spend it on this extra extended belt, extra hotbar slot. Because that way, I can come in here and then I can put the watering can on the end. So we can have a utility on the end, whether that be the torch or the watering can or whatever it may be. And that means we can have all the tools we need, plus some food, in our hotbar. As well as a utility. Let's see if this works. Oh, I think I might have been a bit too far forward. Oh no, I managed it. Nice. Alright, I'm gonna go get some stone. I stuck 200 in, so it should be plenty. The other thing I want to do is I want to make a little box for the stone over here. Um, I haven't got the stone at the moment, so I can't do that. But the same as the wood storage, I can make a stone storage as well. There's plenty of wood in here, that's good. The other thing I want to do today is go and talk to the flower seller. Now that she's got her stall set up, we should have at least we've been away for her for a, for a little bit so maybe we go and pop over there now actually I'll pick up some stone on the way oh and some more flowers to sell her here she is Hi, what's your name again? Steph. Hi, Steph. I've got some flowers for you, I think. Sell, oh, yeah, yeah. Sell for 15, that's good. Mm, I could buy some seeds off her and we could start a little area, but uh, I don't know that I want to do that. Oh, what have we got? We've got quite a few lavender as well. Let's sell the lavender. You got any of these? Mm, a few of those. We sell those as well. Marigolds. So she's got some pots that we can buy the blueprints for as well. Mm, that's cool. I can make things look pretty later. We need the resources for now to get all the gear sorted out. We can make a nice pretty house with some different building materials and things later on. So we've got a little bit of extra coin now and we want to use that coin to buy our next backpack. But this backpack costs 200 and we have got 85 so we need to sell a few things before we can actually afford that. Ah, nice. There's some more lavender grown back. Uh, have we got... Yeah, just the one seed. That's fine. I do need to build some more of those, though. I might just do that now. I think I've got a fair amount of material for it. Let's have a look. It's on this one here. Should be able to build these here. Yeah, nice. Now, we don't need this torch at the moment as well, so we can put that away, swap it out for our watering can. And then we can pour this out. I think why we'll cut down these trees, and I will plant another one here. 
Got a couple of pear seeds there available. Nice. Another pear tree. And another pear tree. Cool. There's a little bit more space there now as well for the rest of these blueberry seeds. It's only a couple there, but we tend to pick up a couple of extra as time goes by. Let's see how we're getting on with this. Oh, we got 15 there. That's pretty good. Uh, this has now made us two of these, and I do want to... Let's stick a couple of those in there. I want to get a couple more at least. Mm, I'll get as many as I can, actually. Still not going to be enough for what we need, but it is going to be enough to upgrade this. We want to need plenty more wood. Thankfully, I've collected a bunch here. But as we've got to wait, we might as well collect up some more. Ah, bees! Bees! Damn those bees. Oh, I should really be checking to see if there's beehives or bird's nests up here rather than just cutting down trees. It's not exactly... Ah, god damn it! It's what happens. Nature bites back. We start cutting down their homes. So it's just about to get dark. I think what I might do is build one of those little lights out the front. Where were they? That's here. Hopefully I can build one outside. Oh yeah. That's cool. Hopefully that will help us find our home in the dark. Let's have a quick look. Well, let's upgrade this anyway. Need plenty more wood. Like I say, I have collected up plenty. So let's take out what we've got here. That's enough. The upgrade. Ping! There we go. There's our new tools. And we can see that we need three hardened steel for that. And we need 20 wood. Should have plenty of wood. Uh, and then we've got loads more weapons as well. I haven't used a shield yet. Um, there's a cool hardened steel spear here. That looks awesome. So that could be fun. But we need lots. Yeah, that needs five hardened steel. So we need to be getting a lot of metal, which means processing. Uh, we're out of coal now as well, so we need, will need to go and get some coal. Alright, let's see how this light works out for us. That's quite nice. It's not going to be any good when adventuring though, is it? So, let's get our torch. So I'm hoping that the trades will be open at night. We'll go and check. Hopefully they're 24 hours. I mean, they've got nothing better to do. To be fair, I'd rather be out of that little hut that they live in. Than, uh, than in it. It's a bit cramped. I'm not sure I'd want to live in this. Can you can only just get in the door. There's no furniture, nothing. Hello! So there's a furniture builder over here. Now, he will accept wood and that's stone, also clay. They only sell, you know, 10 to 1, which is rubbish, really. I guess because they're basic resources. Now, so the only things I've got to sell, really, are my flowers and my fish. And I haven't done any more fishing. To be fair, though, I'm not actually eating the fish. I'm eating my berries that I'm collecting. And that's doing okay. It's not great, but it's okay. I haven't got enough lavender or roses. I haven't got enough flowers in general to be selling them. So I will probably need to buy some seeds, in fact. Oh, who's this? Oh, hello. Not met, not met you before. That's Centane. Hello there. Brings you into the wood this night. Uh, retrieve a backpack. Reset my skills. Oh, I'm fine. Oh, okay. Can I... I can sell my dark essence as well. Uh, I've got a chunk of it. It doesn't sell for very much, though. I'm hoping it's going to be used for crafting at some point, so... I'm going to hold on to it for now. All I really wanted was enough to be able to get the axe. So what do I need now? Just a little bit of wood. All right. Ah. Ah. No bees. Yeah. 
Yeah, cool. So the reason I'm getting the axe and not something else is because this axe is going to allow us to cut down those hardwood trees, uh, which is something that we will need to do. A, because we need the hardwood to donate to the town. And the other reason is because we will need them to upgrade our gear as well. Uh, now we left our raft on this side of the island. Because I couldn't really see what I was doing because we landed in the dark. Um, where is the raft? There it is. Cool. Let's jump over and have a look at these trees on the other side. Here we are. Let's just uh, jump out here. So all we really need is these trees here, I think. See our big power hit there. Did 18 damage. That's pretty good. We're going to need that against these. Yeah, nice. And now we've got some hardwood. So I think that's basically as much of that as we can get. So we're going to jump back over to our starter island. I'll show you what things we can do with it. So what might be quite cool is if I built a port here. We'll maybe do that when we start getting bigger boats. How are we getting on with this? Uh, there's a little bit of wood there. A uh, bit of stone. We might as well do that. I don't think we can use this now because there's no... I've got no coal whatsoever. So if we have a quick look in here as well, here's our items collection. If you see, if we make all of these common, which is what we've upgraded to recently, these common weapons and tools, then we get a special tool at the end once we've collected it. Uh, we've also got one rare one. Again, once we've collected all of the rare ones, we get a special tool. So one of the other things that we can use the hardwood for is we can use it to upgrade our town to a mining town. And we have almost all those materials, actually. So we might as well go out and grab those last materials. I think it was normal wood and stone. Okay, so we should now have the materials to upgrade our town to a mining town. We do. That's going to give us two extra house plots and it's going to give us a five times shop buy sell amount. And a mining outpost apparently as well. Cool. So now there's new plots. Where are these new plots? So we can check on our map actually. Uh, they're both up here next to that other one. That's cool. Oh, look, we've got like bunting now and there's more flowers around. Starting to look quite pretty. And this is now a bridge. That's cool. So here are new plots. This this one here and this one here. I've already started building this one. Just need to build a little house for them. I mean, I say house. Really, we should probably consider it to be a more of a hut or a portaloo or uh, something a shack maybe let's give them a nice roof there we go who are we going to move into here then so we can look at our new villages we've got jared the blacksmith now he sells coal that's going to be super useful he also sells salvage metal uh, this guy martinel he's a humble farmer and he sells seeds for things. And he will also buy our crops. He's probably quite useful. Uh, this is Lucky Jack, the pirate. And he has blueprints for a treasure map. 
Uh, I think that's probably just... don't know. Do you think that's just a cosmetic thing? Do we think that's an actual treasure map? Hmm, we can play Blackjack with him as well. Alright, I think maybe we'll get him later. We're going to have Jared, definitely. Let's move Jared in. Probably thankful that we built him a portaloo. Thanks for building me a portaloo. Come by my blacksmith shop once I've set up and I'll give you a weapon for a great deal. Excellent. Thanks, Jared. So, Martinel. Yeah, let's move Martinel in. Oh, hello there. What a fantastic house. If you need any farming goods, come visit me at my new shop. Sure will. I mean, I might upgrade these later and make them look really cool, but um, I doubt it. Well, I think we're going to call it a day. Thanks for joining me again today. Don't forget to leave a comment, like the videos, and consider subscribing as well if you're not already. If you're enjoying this, come and say hi down below. Until next time, take it easy. Thank you.